stuff. Ev's got some weird stuff to talk about. Oh weird. my gosh, it's weird this week. And hopefully my iPad um, lasts because it's only got 1% now. Anyway, would you ever... <laughs> there it lasts. You've had way yep. too much wine now. Okay, would you ever drink cockroach milk? Yes, for $150,000. Don't, don't dollars. knock my glass over, please. Okay, for $150,000? I'd need to know a little bit more about what okay. it is before I say All this. right, cockroach milk. Yeah, cockroach Apparently, milk could be two things. Cockroach milk mm. is the new craze, okay? Right. Forget almond, forget soy, forget cow's milk. Macadamia? Forget macadamia milk. It's all about the cockroach milk, okay? What about cow's milk? Forget about it. There's a lot of it, though. Okay, there is a, a lot of it. a lot of people drinking it. Yes. Forget about yes. it. But Pretty apparently, popular. cow's milk is the most damaging thing on the planet right now. Mm, I believe it. According to the mirror... <laughs> no, I saw that. <laughs> so more than cars, planes, or nuclear testing, cow's milk is the most damaging thing not on the planet. Cow's milk, cows. <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> the milk itself cows. is not doing anything. <laughs> We're gonna see another flood. <laughs> Except this time, it's cow's milk. <laughs> okay. I mean, maybe the cow's milk is giving people like cholesterol problems and something else mm. maybe it gives me a sore tummy maybe so that is terrible that is worse than nuclear <laughs> weapons right now okay so people are now drinking cockroach milk as a dairy alternative oh my gosh can we <laughs> not watch those this? are cgi oh, cockroaches yeah. I don't it's know important why to <laughs> have this what is this they're toys what is it the audio can't see it okay Sorry. just ignore all it all right <laughs> i can't look at it so the milk is desri- is derived from cockroach crystals. Okay, it's a part of the insect found in its gut. According to scientists, these crystals are like a complete food, rich essential amino acids and proteins. Mm. Okay, sounds pretty good. It sounds pretty good to me. <laughs> this video is oh, so don't. funny. I'm gonna oh, change gosh. it. This is too funny. <laughs> okay, so and funny. apparently it tastes no different from cow's milk. Exactly yeah, that's the what they taste. say. I but people say before. the same thing about <laughs> almond milk, and they're hundred percent wrong. Of the, uh, who says that about almond people milk? People say it tastes good. I drink almond milk. What is wrong with you? They don't. They don't taste the same. But I'm I okay used to with drink soy milk, milk before mm. I drank almond milk. I'm, you know, I'm one of those hipsters. I just go in the crazy. So I'm probably <laughs> next week. I'm if probably it says drinking milk, cockroach you're drinking milk. It. <laughs> I'm, I'm not sure you know what a hipster is. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. I don't like cow's milk, okay? <laughs> I don't like it. Cows, because the cows are killing the planet. Well, mm. what's so, the benefit? You've been well, seeing cowspiracy. Well, the benefit is it's like a whole complete food. That's it. <laughs> so you just eat what, the cockroach what, the, uh, the scientists did seem to be saying it had a lot of stuff that you need. Like more than cow's milk. Yes. So amino acids and stuff that like okay. are the so basic one building th- blocks of your body. Like, yes. So mm. it's high in protein content. Rich in minerals such as iron, zinc, and calcium. It sounds pretty good to me. Good for your bones. Zinc is great for you, isn't it? I really wanted to see the process (coughs) of how they milk the cockroach. I know, right? (laughs) That's what I was... I was reading the whole thing, trying to figure out how they do it. Because when you you squish them with your shoe, there's like this white milky stuff that comes out. I don't think that's it. I think that's that's their guts. It says crystals Uh in their stomach. Yeah. Yes. How many? It does say that. It could be their guts... And that but stuff. I think most of the gooey Maybe. stuff is not from in the stomach. Right. How many cockroaches do you need to get like a cup of cockroaches? <laughs> I do not know. It I was don't a know thousand. The answer to that. It, it, actually, it was a it thousand to get a hundred grams. Yeah. Oh, well, there it was a thousand to get a hundred oh, yeah. grams. That is what it takes as many as a thousand cockroaches to make just a hundred grams of milk. Who's thinking of the poor cockroaches that are sacrificing themselves? Are it's you probably that guy from Men in Black. See? Yeah. When do you let a cockroach live? Water. I go like this. No, you don't. I do. You go, ee. I had one in my I room the other day and it was flying. Do you know what I do to Flying is different. Every time I close my eyes, like turn off the lights, close my eyes, I could hear it flying. <laughs> oh. Me. This is how I kill cockroaches. I put them in the sink and I turn the boiling water on. Oh, my gosh. How do you get them into the sink? And I watch them. You're a bloody water waster. <laughs> yeah. I out of watch my them in the sink, the hot water's on, and they are literally burning and de- drowning to death. Oh, are no. you sure they're not just chilling out like it's a jacuzzi? They're not chilling out, trust me. I they're remember what I did with them. A bloody nuclear war. How are they not going to survive some hot water? 
How do you get them into the sink? Definitely not alive when I'm finishing. I, I don't them. know. So you have sufficient control <laughs> over the cockroach to get it in the sink alive. Why don't you just kill it? Because I like to watch it die. You are evil. <laughs> they take so disturbing. long to die, though. I scoop it up with a tissue. I'm just saying, it's kind of mildly Flush satisfying. Him. Flush them. I do the same thing, but like squash it when I'm scooping Ugh. it and then put it in the bin. No, you need to it. use a really thick paper towel then because the goo is going to get through that. Why don't that. you just the like goo. slam it with, goo. A, with a... <laughs> the goo, buddy. If you, <laughs> if you flush it, maybe it's got a chance. Maybe we'll start a new life down there. You don't know. Maybe, yeah. maybe. Okay, so that's it for um. Cockroach. So, for we, would, cockroach so we, would all, okay. we would all try that, that's right? That's number one. for sure. I would definitely would really, give it a go. I don't know if I'd try it at all. I want to test that it tastes the same. But if somebody cool was drinking it, I'd probably... Like if it had time. good, if it had good packaging, I'd be okay with it. But if it was just, <laughs> if it was just in a cup and someone said it, I, I just wouldn't trust the person. To be fair, they described. But if somebody it, said he have a cup of milk, and you didn't know. Oh well, then that's a completely different scenario. That's called <laughs> espionage. Also, also, then you would drink it because you thought it was normal milk. That's right. So, I don't know. I wouldn't milk. Disgusting. What are you asking? I don't like normal milk. No. I love normal milk. Oh, but anyway, disgusting. it does anyway. sound like it has all the same stuff as milk, so I would assume it would actually taste the same. Yeah. Okay. Milk's all gross. right. So moving on then from mm. cockroaches. Yeah. We actually have some sad news in weird news tonight. Devastating. There is an Australian marsupial on the verge of extinction. <gasps> is it the quokka? What's it called? It's called the silver-headed antichinus and the black-tailed dusky antichinus. Excuse me? Yeah. <laughs> they were only discovered in 2013. Oh, wow. <laughs> and now they're extinct. Out. And the reason is they're having too much sex. Okay? Mm. That yeah. normally doesn't they... cause that problem. <laughs> So apparently, <laughs> these animals—they're mm. um, mostly found up around in Queensland. They uh, go from absolutely prime health mm. to falling to pieces before your very eyes. And in the winter, they because like in the winter they have this annual frenzied fortnight of mating. Okay, a whole fortnight <laughs> of mating in winter. And they're fine at the beginning of the fortnight, and at the end, they're gone. They die? They die. They literally die. Like both and the males call... and the females no, die? No, just mostly the males, okay? So mm. it, they reckon the exhausting marathon sessions see the animals attempt to hang on to so many female mates and fight off so many rivals that they end up producing lethal levels of testosterone. <laughs> Yeah. Whoa. So the excess stops a stress hormone from switching off, destroying their organs and eventually killing them. They're honestly like the walking dead towards the end. So the males go crazy, have a sex crazy time. Yes. But the females, they get impregnated. So That's they're right. okay. The, so the females are fine. So wouldn't they not go extinct? So then they're the, all getting pregnant. So female, they reckon females have a lifespan of about two years um, and about half only ever breed once giving birth to between 6 and 14 offspring, the males die before their first birthday. I feel like this is a decent survival strategy. Like mm. spiders do it and that seems is to work out a, for them. Is this it? No. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> I just... I, I type <laughs> in marsupial one. sex and click <laughs> the first thing. <laughs> the little one came out to wow. see what was going on. Oh, my god. Well, that's how it works. It's it's a real problem. Yeah, it's a serious problem. It's, I was thinking like we about it. We only discovered them in 2013 and now... I think if you give most guys the choice to go out that way, death by snoo snoo, mm. they probably reckon? say yes. Yeah. <laughs> go out okay, in your from prime. All of, let's take a poll. Fourteen days. Is that? Would you go out that way? That's quite a high proportion of their lifespan spent. Ha- Before lifespan your first spent birthday. having sex. No, nah, I'd spread it out. You know. Come on. So what? You might have said this already, but why do they just keep having sex? Okay, so it's something um, to do with hormones. Their body produ- keeps producing testosterone, yes. which overwhelms their other instinct, which is telling them, stop having sex, you're breaking down as a yeah. end, as right. So the Yeah, the excess testosterone stops <laughs> the stress oh, no. hormone from switching off. Too human-like. This is not <laughs> marsupial sex. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I hate monkeys. <laughs> well, technically, you they hate are monkeys. marsupials, are they? What's wrong with you? Um, yeah, it's really sad. <laughs> but they're, they're having too much sex and they're dying. Can relate. Can you? <laughs> oh my god! Some of these related videos. 
You really One of them says introducing a, a, a mouse rapist. Oh and it's gosh. just a mouse. <laughs> oh, poor mouse. Okay, so do you want to hear the last story? Which is not about animals. Know. Although I think she is a bit of an animal for doing this. Okay, well, sure. Okay? So imagine this. You are at a beautiful hotel. Mm. You're swimming in the pool, mm-hmm. loving it, having a great time. And you look over. Yeah. And a woman is sitting on the side of the pool with a razor, oh. shaving her legs. I've seen, I've seen that video. Have you seen it? I've seen it. There's a video. There is <laughs> definitely a video. You could watch it on my iPad if you want. Oh, I, I'll just wait. For it's okay. horrific. It's to, disgusting. To be fair, it doesn't look like a nice hotel. Okay, sure. So maybe it's an average hotel. Let's say. Three stars? Oh, gee. Maybe a motel. Yeah, that's her. <laughs> she's quite a large There's like lady, 10 kids around her. And there's all these people around her. There's a and lot she's of like small children right there. The, Why are the, the children still the pool. there? Swish, swish. It's Why are the children? Why has no one pulled those children out of there? They're like Look, drinking Look, she's like got the back hair. of the leg going. It's uh, In it's, her defense, she doesn't look that hairy. You can't, you see, can't see the hair. I, I the got resolution on this. You got the resolution on this. Okay. Can't even make out her arms. Like, it's like two pixels. She's obviously hairy enough that she needs to shave. I wonder if people would have been upset if she was like a really hot. Yeah. Girl. Oh, I didn't think of that. True. No. no one would care. I think it'd still be. Ugh. No, no. One would no, care. you think that because you're a woman. <laughs> what do you think and, of that? But you guys, woman, are you, uh, guys, are you turned on by, by guys <laughs> or people attracted to women? If that was a hot woman doing that <laughs> with her legs out on the pool, I feel like they'd and find a way to true. make it sexy. Yeah, it's I know true. it's really disappointing to say this, and you it hurts me to disgusting. say it. Disgusting. But I think it wouldn't have been a thing. Really? Well, or if it was a thing, it would have been a sexy. Be very different thing. <laughs> You, so you're totally we're, okay with think, a hot think, chick you know what, shaving no, her legs okay. in we're, the pool. We're not Let's okay. Give you some context. Look. Okay. If a woman like that put her leg up on the side of a pool like that, that's already damn sexy. Okay. Let alone, let this alone, one. Okay, sure. No, <laughs> a, this one, a, a very attractive one. woman yeah. had her okay, leg sure. perched up on the side I'm, of a pool. I'm cool yeah. with that. Other leg down, like already free. Okay. And if she was doing something in motion with her body, <laughs> and like, look, a ra- what, what do you the think about? Jury's not out. That's that's good. And when <laughs> the razor's there, you think. But what if she went swish swish with the razor no. in the water? Well, swish swish. Where do people <laughs> shave their legs? In the shower, in the bath, and people are naked in the bath. So that's oh. where your mind goes. Really. Look. We're not saying this because we're proud of it. <laughs> not that it's oh, acceptable. I'm so glad. We're just saying right that's how it would have gone down, and. <laughs> I know it's disappointing to hear, yeah. but it's I'm, the truth. I'm really just quite shocked truth. right now. It's disappointing to say. Yeah. Wow. It okay. hurts you as much as it hurts us. Well, yeah. probably more. <laughs> okay, so <Yeah>. what then? <laughs> what is, like, too far for you then? Like, <laughs> You don't want to know. <laughs> what could possibly That's a pretty good be, question. What no, could, what like, could a really hot woman just, be doing exactly. in a pool that wouldn't be attractive? Yeah. We just like, covered what? a story about a marsupial that has sex <laughs> until it dies because of testosterone. Yeah. And that same chemical is going let... through our brains. Are we that different? No. Probably not. Actually, you're not. <laughs> wow, guys. I've really learned something new about you all mm. tonight. Whatever. But anyway, this one sparked we'll outrage. So let's let's be outraged. <laughs> Um, there's wow. probably a guy that was really into what was happening on that screen. Well, there seemed to only there's be females many guys in that pool. There. Do you think it was a male on the camera? The only thing I was like, outraged really about is why this. are those kids right next to this woman? Oh, I, She's yeah. going to be wish- swishing it in the water <laughs> and little bits of hair are going to be floating <laughs> and they've no. got their mouths at the waterline. and it's like, This is why what you, you should doing? not go to public pools mm. at all. Or Swim at least take your kids out of there before when that happens. Don't just film the lady. you will be fine. Do not go to a public pool. That's yeah. not true. You might get eaten by a shark. Well, yeah, but at least you won't get little hairs. <laughs> <laughs> it's much worse, don't I? <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, I lost all sense of proportion. Yeah. My bad. Anyway. Yeah. So oh, that's it. Good that's, job, Ev. That, mm. That's weird this that's week. Weird it, was, it was very, very weird. Ah, okay. Speaking <laughs> of weird. weird. <laughs>